Well, hi guys. Um, today we're going to have a quick look at uh, how easy it is actually on uh, just about any Linux system to use a command line to actually write uh, images to to devices such as USB memory sticks and so forth. Um, uh, it's it's using a command called dd, which is as far as I know available on just about every version of Linux out there. If it isn't, you can definitely install it. Um, but it's a very quick, simple tool. However, highly dangerous. Um, you do have to run it with pseudo privileges, and uh, you could very easily overwrite a hard drive if you uh, put in the wrong parameters to the command. I'm speaking from first-hand experience. I did exactly that yesterday. Luckily, it was a backup hard drive of a backup hard drive, so it's no problems. Um, but I'll show you how to do it. So. Okay, if we go and look at the current moment at uh, um, LS block, uh, LS block, all right, um, it tells us this is everything that's connected to the, the computer at the moment. Um, you'll notice here, this is the hard drive I overwrote yesterday. <laughs> I saw the word free agent and thought that was my USB memory stick and it wasn't. Okay, so, um, so if you look at that, now if I do attach the memory stick, uh, just give me a sec, all right, it's going in. Let's wait for it to be detected. Okay, it's found it. So if we rerun uh, Alice block now, we'll find uh, uh, we've got SD, A, B, and C. We should now have D as well. And there we have it, we've got SD, D. All right. Um, so the, the actual file I want to write to this memory stick, I want to use this memory stick to boot up um, my laptop um, with Linux on it to do an installation. Um, now, I mean, if we, if we just look in the current folder, um, what files I can write here, some of the, the, the images I have, let's just take something small, like, uh, let, yes, something, 870 meg, so it's just Ubuntu one, all right, and, uh, let's just copy that. Okay, so, um, so if we want to copy that over to, um, the, the USB memory stick, which is SDD. All right, do not con get confused about that. Make 100% sure about that. All right, so just sudo dd. All right, um, there we go, equals progress. All right, then uh, if for our input file, if equals, okay, which is going to be this Ubuntu file, okay, and then um, of for output file equals, all right. And this is the tricky bit. This is where you've got to be careful, okay? So it is uh, forward slash dev uh, device forward slash SDD. This is the one you should not get wrong, all right? And uh, it'll go ahead and, and write that file. Um, so uh, it'll ask me for my password. Uh, oops. Uh, Uh, oh, what did I do wrong? Unrecognized operand dev sdd. Uh, yes, sorry, I had that uh, after the of equal, I had a space and then the device. Should be no spaces. Okay, and uh, it's busy copying that over. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Alrighty, and that's done. And uh, so yes, um, if we now go and look at our files, um, well, we can open up our file explorer here, and uh, we should now see that we have an attached device that's got Ubuntu on it. And uh, there we have it. Here's Ubuntu server. All right, so that's reading from the USB memory stick. You can take that now to another computer and uh, boot up from it and install Ubuntu. Um, I've done the same with uh, OpenSUSE Tumbleweed, I've done it with uh, Arch, uh, I've done it with Windows even. Um, so yes, um, it's very simple. You don't need to download all sorts of things to, to write your USB stick. Just use DD. It's available everywhere. Anyway, thanks guys. Enjoy your day and uh, catch you next time. See you man. Bye.